Hello everyone and welcome to the One Man Renegade Podcast YouTube channel. I'm your host, the Honorable Greg B. And it is Saturday, so it's time for Subscription Saturday. Uh, we're doing a June 2020 jampacks.net. Old school jampacks. Yes, I know it's well past June, but I, I'm still trying to catch up. I got a bunch of subscription boxes and I was taking a little vacation, so I didn't have access to my mail and, well, whatever. It is what it is. It is here. If you've missed any of the jam packs in the past, go check on the, up there and go check those out. If you're new to the channel, head on down, hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, uh, then head on down to the comments um, and let me know what you liked about this product this, this month, maybe your favorite card or something like that. Then check out the links where you can get a link to find one of your own jam packs and also some links to my podcast and my social media. Also share and like the video. All right, let's move on. Uh, 2020, June. Um, I, I, I would, wouldn't even guess to try to remember what they said was going to be in this box. Probably something cool. I feel like 88, no, sorry, not 88, 82 Fleer maybe, or Donruss. I feel like they sent out a, a picture on, uh, on their Instagram kind of showing what was going to, kind of the bigger, um, packs were going to be in this box. But we'll also get Hall of Famer. Uh, rookie card, Hall of Famer autograph, and there'll be a nice little pack of some fun stuff too. Uh, here's the autograph and the uh, rookie. We'll do that next week, as I like to split this up into two parts because there's a lot of it's a lot of packs. It takes a while. And here's our little uh, team bag of some stars and stuff. We'll check that out. And they always like to include uh, some sleeves and top loaders, which is really nice. Because these are getting harder and harder to find these days. I don't know what's going on. There's been a run of them um, on the card shops online and, and stuff. So uh, even on Amazon and stuff like eBay too. The, the prices have been going up. I don't know. I mean, I don't know what's going on. I mean, a lot of people are collecting and putting together their uh, sets and are putting together, collect, you know, going through the cards, buying some cards. I don't know. So they need the sleeves and the top loaders. So yeah, um, nice to know they're still providing them because they're getting more expensive by the day hopefully that changes soon uh maybe they can ramp up production at uh ultra pro and uh the other one that i'm not thinking of the name of <laughs> there's the other brand too there's a few other brands but uh ultra pro and then the other one <laughs> all right so here we go all right so i was correct 82 donruss there we go uh, then we also got 87 tops, 88 Fleer, 89 Donruss, 89 tops, 90 tops, 90 Bowman, 91 uh, Bowman. Uh, so some of the uh, usual suspects uh, we'll be looking for. Rookie cards of some Hall of Famers and stars from the 80s and 90s. Um, typical jam packs uh, kind of style. It's It's just fun. I mean... Not, not, a lot of these cards don't hold a lot of value just because they're so overproduced, but, you know, it's just it's just fun. All right, you know what? I'm not even going to, like, bother going through. Well, no, nah, maybe I should. I'm going to go quickly go through these. All right, so we got a rack pack of 89 score. We got 90 tops, as mentioned. 92 score, Series 2. Uh, 91 uh, Fleer Ultra. We got a 91 Studio. We got a 91 Leaf Series 1. We got a 92 Donra Series 1. We got a 92 Leaf Series 1. We got a 90 uh, Upper Deck. I think this is Low Series. I always get confused by these. It usually says High Series somewhere. I think it would say it there if it was High Series, but regardless. Um, and then we got Upper Deck 92. Um, again, I think this is low series. Um, I think it would say high series up there, if I remember correctly. So there you go. Uh, those are going to be... Should we open these today? Yeah, we'll do these today. And then next week, we'll go through the rest of these. We got uh, 89 tops. That's 88 Donruss. Then 87 tops, 90 Bowman, 91 Bowman, uh, and 82... Donruss, 88 Fleer, and 89 Donruss. We'll do those. Uh, oh, and there's a rack pack. Oh, and there's a random other pack in here. <laughs> the 92 Fleer. All right, and there's a rack pack of 88 tops. All right, 
yeah so those are next week this week we're doing uh this first stack i don't want these to fall over um there we go and then we'll do this uh, team bag as well all right so let's just dive in uh doesn't really matter where we start looking for fun stuff uh 92 bow uh 92 upper deck we can you know get the manny ramirez um the ted williams that'd be fun uh, I can't think of what else that's in 92 upper deck, but here we go. Uh, Jeff Juden, star rookie, sure. Willie Banks, star rookie, if you say so. Mike Stanton, but not the Mike Stanton that then became the, yeah, Giancarlo Stanton. It's the other Mike Stanton, the one, the old Mike Stanton. Uh, Joe Oliver, <laughs> sorry, David Wells. Back when he was still with the Blue Jays. Chuck Finley before he... Well, I don't want to talk about Chuck Finley. Howard Johnson. Kelly Gruber. Got Junior Felix. Ernest Riles. Uh, George Brett. That's a nice one. He's a Hall of Famer. Uh, Matt Young. Pitched no-hitter and lost once for the Red Sox, which was fun. Uh, David West, but not the David West, the basketball player, because clearly not the same guy. Um, and he also is playing a different sport. That's, but which that doesn't mean you can't play two sports. But playing two sports a decade apart and looking completely different would be the other problem. I mean, Danny H played basketball and uh, ba baseball. Uh, Adam Peterson and Scott Terry round out that pack. Uh, let's move on to ninety upper deck. Uh, looking for Larry Walker, Frank Thomas, Sammy Sosa rookies. Um, as well as Hall of Famers and stars of the era. Uh, Mike Pagliero, low, well, however you say it. Uh, then we got Darnell Coles, checklist, always fun. Uh, Vaughn Hayes, we got Terry Steinbeck, Jeff Hamilton, Jay Bell, Larry Sheets. Got a sticker of the Texas Rangers to go along with Gary Milkey. Because he is also a Texas Ranger. Uh, Zane Smith, Willie Randolph, Pat Tabler, Kevin Ritz, uh, rookie card, George Canal, and Norm Charlton. There's nothing really to speak of out of that pack. Uh, we got 92 uh, Leaf Series 1. Um, out of Series 1, I don't remember who was in Series 1. I know, I know Jeff Kent has his rookie card in here, but don't know if he was in series one or not all right we got ken caminiti uh jose rijo ben mcdonald jeff reardon we got brian smith dante bichette when he was on the brewers i i gotta say i don't remember him on the brewers uh let, ken ken caminiti again for some reason greg gagne uh scott sanderson uh john olerud greg jeffries frank viola Jose De Leon, Roberto Alomar is a Hall of Famer, and Dave Howard Leaf, Gold Leaf, Black Leaf, whatever, Gold, Black Gold Leaf card, Black Gold card, I believe is what those were card. All right, 92, uh, Donra Series 1, there's really nothing to speak of in this unless we find an Elite card, which I've never seen an Elite card in person in my life, so I highly doubt it, but, um, we also get a you know, puzzle piece. Jeff Treadway, Joe Oliver again, Marquise Grissom, Carlos Garcia, Rene Gonzalez, Kevin Gross, Lou Whitaker, Drug Dreback, Kevin Moss, Pedro Guerrero, Ken Griffey Jr. That's a nice one. Um, Hall of Famer, of course. Chili Davis, Mike Lavalier, Matt Noakes, and Todd Zeal rounding round in things up for that pack so ken griffey jr that's pretty good i mean there's you know as far as uh big stars from back in the day to get a card of i mean it's probably ripkin ryan griffey and you know some order bonds mcguire clemens those guys are always kind of yeah because they're not hall of famers but they're obviously big stars and there's all the you know steroid stuff regarding them but all right we're moving on to 91 leaf series one again i can't think of anything notable in this set uh outside of just hall of famers and stuff 
Will Cordero, uh, Gold Leaf card. We got Tom Browning, Randy Reddy, Dave Justice. Uh, the Leaf set is as a checklist. No, it's literally just a card explaining what the set is. Sweet. <laughs> Jay Buhner, Doug Jones, Lee Gutterman, Tom Bolton, Paul Ostenmacher, Tom Her, Her, Jimmy Key, Jay Howell, Matt Williams, and Tom Browning again. Why does that keep happening? What is happening? What is going on? Just doubling up on all the cards. I don't get it. Ken Caminiti, Tom Browning. All right, moving on. We got 91 uh, Studio. Um, can't say that there's any rookies in here of note, but I'm obviously looking for Hall of Famers and Robin Yount right off the bat is a Hall of Famer. Uh, Mo Bond, not a Hall of Famer. Um, Jack Morris is a Hall of Famer. Lance Parrish, not a Hall of Famer. Ozzy Smith is a Hall of Famer. Daryl Kyle is not a Hall of Famer and unfortunately no longer with us. Fred McGriff, not a Hall of Famer. A lot of people think he yeah, maybe should be, but I don't know. His numbers weren't quite good enough, but yet he was never a steroid guy. It's always one of those weird things where it's like, he wasn't associated at all with steroids, but his numbers weren't quite good. But if he was on steroids, his numbers would have been amazing, but he wouldn't have got into the Hall of Fame because of that. So I don't know. It's it's it's, it's a catch-22 for the most part. Uh, Fred McGriff, uh, but not a Hall of Famer for a night. Uh, Bob Ojeda, definitely not a Hall of Famer. Willie McGee, not a Hall of Famer. Mike Fitzgerald, and a uh, puzzle piece. <clears throat> now, I wonder, I've never really put it together any of the puzzles, I'll be honest, from all the Donruss and Leaf uh, products from back in the day. But were the puzzle pieces all the same every year? So, like, could you put together, like, some sort of Frankenstein puzzle of, like, the different guys from the different years? I don't know. I've never really looked that closely at them, so I wouldn't know. But it'd be kind of cool. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe I'm just tired. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. Maybe I'm delirious. All right. Uh, 91 uh, Fleer Upper Deck. Nope. That doesn't make sense. Fleer Ultra. Like I said, I it's it's late. I've been up all day. Uh, but I'm trying to get some recording in. All right. We're starting things off with a sticker of the Minnesota Twins. Uh, so cool. Uh, Tim Beckler, BJ Surhoff, Jose Rijo, Mark Gabizga. Uh, I don't remember how his name says. Jerome Walton, Travis Fryman, Odeby McDowell. Uh, Mc, yeah, McDowell. I was just thinking of the other McDowells. Like, wait a minute. John Crook, Shay Mack, uh, Ricky Henderson, uh, Team Ultra Team Fleer card? Uh, I don't know if I've ever seen these cards before. Huh. Hall of Famer, though. So that's cool. I'll take it. Annie Vance Lake, Terry Shumpert, Pedro Guerrero, and Howard Johnson round things up. All right, moving on. We got uh, 92 uh, score series um, two. We got a special consumer offer. Uh... I don't remember what's in this set, to be quite honest with you. Probably nothing amazing. It's like, it's like I can't remember if like Manny was in this or not. I, I, I don't remember. Uh, Kyle Abbott, Kevin Campbell, Jeff Gardner, uh, Lady Renfro, Mark Davis, uh, Daryl Irvine, Jeff Facero, Rod Beck, Tino Martinez, Tino Martinez, Trevor Wilson, Sh Sean Abner, Tim Lavana, Tony Phillips, Greg Myers, Junior Ortiz, and Gerald Perry. All right, moving on. We got uh, 90 tops. Uh, we got some gum in here. Uh, we're looking for the Frank Thomas no name on front card, which would be ridiculous if I found that in this, but it's possible. But if not, the regular Frank Thomas would be cool too. Gum doesn't look too bad, but I'm not going to try it. Um, all right. We also got Sosa, Larry Walker, Bernie Williams, Jack Morris, Hall of Famer. I love center though. Dante Bichette, second year card. Kevin Elster, Bobby Valentine. Not sure if that was the year when he pretended. No, he was in the Mets then. Um, what happened with Ray? Oh, I, I remember. My first game I was ever at, or one of the first games I was ever at, he got thrown out of the game. I do remember that. 
when he was the manager for the Rangers. Uh, Jerry Rose, uh, Mark Lemke, Fred Lynn on the Tigers. Wow, didn't realize he was still playing in 1989, well, I guess. Uh, Hensley Mullins, uh, Vance Law, Brian Smith again, Craig McMurtry, uh, Todd Be Benzinger, Spike Owen, Tony Pena, Rick Roden, and Teddy Hagera. So nothing great out of that pack, unfortunately. Moving on to this rack pack of, what year was this, 89 score. Now, unfortunately, uh, there's no, and I, wow, that was, okay. <laughs> that was not what I was trying to do, but that worked. Uh, unfortunately, no Griffey, and he was in the traded set. I think there's a Randy Johnson, pretty sure. Uh, I forget what other, which other of the rookies had cards in this set. But anyways, Dave Stewart, Sid Bream, Andres Galarraga, Rob Murphy, Heath Miller, Heath Miller. Mike Heath, wow, I am, uh. Yeah, <laughs> I don't even know where that came from. A date or a year to remember, 1962. I don't remember 1962. Uh, Dave Rigetti, uh, Don Carmen, Greg Booker, Jerry Don Gleaton, Fernando Valenzuela, Mike Fitzgerald, Bobby Meacham, Jeff Sellers, and Matt Williams, second year card. All right, get into the second part of this rack back. And let's just get the other part of the rack back out too. When did they? Do they? I, I'm I'm assuming they don't still make rack packs. I wonder what the last year they did make rack packs for. Anyways, we got Willie Wilson, Rick Renteria, Rich Renteria, Glenn Braggs. Another year to remember, 1976. Which again, I don't remember. Kevin Bass, uh, Goose Gossage. He's a Hall of Famer. Tim Burke, Bob Stanley, Scott Terry. Mike Smithson, Smithson uh, Mike Boddicker, Tom Bolton, Jose uh, Acundo, uh, Mario Soto, Mark Williamson, John Davis, Jody Reed, like, what is this, a glossy card? Interesting. These must have been exclusive to the Rock Packs. I, I don't remember these at all. Okay, cool. Steve Sachs, uh, of course, he's most remembered for me by being in the Simpsons episode, but... That's neither here nor there. Tony Armas, Bo Diaz, another year to remember of 1969. I mean, I know it's still, a lot of stuff happened in 1969, but I don't wasn't there for it. Uh, Jack Morris, uh, Hall of Famer. Ken Phelps, Joe Orsulak. Don August, Steve Lombardo Dozy. Yeah. Uh, Cicillo Chiante, maybe. I don't know. Jeff Con. Kunkel, got to be careful with that one. Uh, Greg Harris, uh, Keith Miller, not to be confused with Mike Keith or whatever I said earlier, or Keith Miller, Keith Miller. That, yeah, Terry Crancona, <laughs> Mike Diaz, and Bob Melvin round things out. So nothing, nothing great out of that. But uh, then we got these bad boys. Um, let's see, we got. I mean, obviously got Rod Cruz up front. We got Eddie Murray in the back. So. I can open this team bag up. Look at the rest of these cool cards. All right, we got. Uh, all right, let's flip it around. Eddie Murray, that's eighty-one. Yeah, eighty-one Fleer. We got uh, Rod Carew, eighty-one tops All Star. Um, Fleer, ninety-five. Frank Thomas, Diamond Tribute. Andre Dawson, All Star card from nineteen eighty-three. Three. No, 84. Sorry. George Brett Gold card from 1992. Tops. Dan Sexually, 86. Don Russ. Uh, Ken Griffey Jr., 90. Fleer. That's cool. Gary Carter Stark sticker from Fleer, 86, I guess. A 90, was this, 94 upper deck. Barry Larkin. Um, no, 95. Sorry. SP. Okay. Dwight Gooden from 90 Leaf. Uh, Ricky Henderson from 92? No, 93 Bowman. I forget what year this is. 94 Bowman? 95 Bowman? Some, some One of those years. <laughs> and then 92 Hit Club Nolan Ryan card. So a lot of Hall of Famers in there. Are they all? Wait, are they all Hall of Famers? 
They are, right? Yeah. No, Dwight Gooden's not. Dwight Gooden is not a Hall of Famer. Other than that, everyone else in there was. Uh, so there you go. That's cool. First part of uh, uh, Jam Packs, uh, June 2020. I know I'm way behind, but uh, come back next week when we do the rest of them, including the autograph and the rookie card of a Hall of Famer. Uh, thank you, everyone, for watching. Hit that subscribe and like and share and all that fun stuff. And come back next week. Thank you for watching. Bye.